um, we still a bit unclear why it happened to these children. Why until age of two and a half they are doing perfectly well and all of a sudden one day they're waking up, shut their, themselves and um, change, basically changing day by day. You see your child in front of your eyes is changing because it's affected by autism. Marina, autism is a neurodevelopmental disorder. That means that while the child was developing, either in the womb or uh, when he is born, there is some defect or that either there is a lack of oxygen uh, which has led to damage in very deep parts of the brain. And that leads to various problems. A neurodevelopmental disorder can be very severe and very mild. Uh, your child is an autism spectrum disorder. Uh, there are different causes which are attributed to it, though a lot of research is happening as to what is the reason. Some people attribute it to genetic cause, some people attribute it to parental age, uh, sometimes even to vaccinations. So what exactly the reason is, nobody knows. But now we do know to a certain extent what goes wrong in the brain. Uh, we know that there are certain areas in the brain which are affected, which are known as hippocampus, amygdala and cerebellum. And these blue areas denote, uh, as shown in a PET CT scan of the brain, that these areas are functioning lesser. And these areas are responsible for the three main uh, problems uh, in a child with autism. And that is communication, where there is a problem, either the child does not speak or if the child speaks, it is irrelevant or there is repetitive speech. Social interaction, as you said, the child goes into a shell that is not interested in the surroundings. And the third would be abstract uh, imagination and logical thinking. But uh, it, it can, medications and therapy together may help lessen the problem. So now there are newer modalities of treatment which are coming, for example, stem cell therapy.